sad moment when we realize this is getting too small for him. You're growing. Oh my God, aren't you just the cutest little thing? Look at that little head. Oh my gosh. Dash is making his special appearance up there. Anyways, welcome back to my channel, guys. My name's Cassie, if you are new here. So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a little day of my life. I'm gonna take you guys along with me on my day today. It is Wednesday morning. I think it's around 7.30, and I'm about to do a little home workout. So I woke up this morning and it's raining, it's gloomy, it's gray out. I have no motivation to go to the gym whatsoever. So I'm thinking I'm gonna do a little home workout. Sarah's Days actually posted one of her 25 minute real time workouts on YouTube and I did it the other day and it was actually a really good one. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna do that today. Do you wanna come down? Come here. Ah, oh, say hi to the vlog. Say hi to the vlog. Oh, he's very antsy. Say hi. Oh, very antsy. Anyway, so I'm thinking I'm gonna do her workout today. I didn't really feel like going to the gym, so I'm just gonna do a little home workout and take you guys along on my day with me. This morning I had coffee, I had a little pre-workout snack, I had a piece of toast with peanut butter, I had chia seeds on it, cinnamon, it was so good. That's been my like go-to pre-workout lately. What is the matter? Oh, what is that growl? He's very, very, very playful right now. But yeah, let's go get a quick workout in because then I have to start work for the day. I got Dash these new bowls on Amazon. They're a little big for him, but I think he'll grow into them. Do you like your new bowls? Dash. Yes, he does like them. Do you want to eat? Want to eat breakfast? Good boy. Good boy. What are you doing? Okay, so here is the workout. It's a full body cardio burn session. No equipment, it's just like body weight. I just wanted to do something quick, easy, simple because I have to work the rest of the day, so I wanted to move my body a little bit, but I had literally no motivation to go to the gym today. The weather outside is so depressing. <laughs> so apologies for the horrible lighting in here. I know I'm gonna die, I'm pretty sore, and even just testing out one of the first collaborative it's basically like thrive market but instead of food it's more household products like cleaning products things like that so I'm gonna show you guys what I got it's my first time ordering from them but I really wanted to get a subscription with this company there is a trial as well because I literally never remember ever to get cleaning products at the store and I feel like the ones that I like I really like mrs. Mayer's it's always sold out at Wegmans and I do use thrive as well but I just really wanted to try out this one so I still love thrive but this is a little bit more designated to like household cleaning products and they also had things like sponges and like household little gadgets I guess you could say I don't know I'll show you guys what I got it just came in the mail today need to get a box cutter wow it's packaged really nicely I'll show you what it looks like also I think on your first order it came with like a bunch of extra free stuff which was a win-win so I'll show you guys first off what I got I got a bunch of Mrs. Mayer's stuff Dash what are you doing he's like sitting over there staring at me First, I got Mrs. Mayer's, the lavender scent. It's my favorite, you'll see in like a little trend. This is the multi-surface everyday cleaner. I love this one, I use it all the time. And this is also the same scent lavender, but the dish soap. Like Their products smell amazing. Then another one, same scent, but is the hand soap. So I thought this would be good for the bathroom. What's the matter, Dash? Hold that thought. Do you wanna make an appearance? 
Did you want to make an appearance? Are you all wet? Oh God, do they pee inside? Uh, did you go potties inside? Your legs are all wet. Yeah, they are. Huh, hold on. Okay, I don't think he did. Maybe it's from when he went out earlier. Just hang out here. I don't know if you can see his little head. Okay, anyways, then I got the laundry set boosters. So I really like when my clothes smell really good after the washer and the dryer. So I wanted to try these out. Same set, Mrs. Mayer's lavender. I'll let you guys know how I like this. Then I also got these walnut scrubber sponges. So this is really good for when you have like pots and pans that might have like a bunch of grime on them from cooking. These got rated pretty well. It has like a tough scrubber with a soft touch so you can like scrub your pots and pans. This is a bubble up soap dish. This is kind of like a soap dish that you would put with your sponges. Let me open it up and show you guys like what it actually looks like. So it comes with this little sponge dish, bubble up sponge dish, and it has this little like contraption here. I think what you do is you put water and soap on the bottom and that way you use less, but I think it just like gives you more suds for your soap. I don't really know, I just saw it on there, so I'll let you guys know how I like this. Then I got, oh, this I'm super excited about. So I saw this on the website and my friend Stephanie actually had it too, but it's basically the same thing as the bubble up dish before, but it has this little cute round wooden like bristle brush, I guess, and then it's like a sponge. So you can scrub your pots, your pans, your dishes, and it also has this little thing down here as well. I think you put your soap and your water in here and then it just kind of like bubbles up. So I'm excited to have this on my sink because right now I have handle brush I use and I don't know, I just felt like I kind of wanted something that looked a little cleaner and I really needed a new one anyway. So I'm excited for this. I have no clue what this is. Dash, what are you doing? I really have no clue what this is. No idea what this is. We'll have to see what that goes with. And then let's see what else I got. Oh yeah, okay. This is for your dish soap. And I just thought it looked really pretty because it's glass. So I got this, I'm gonna put my dish soap in it. I think I'm gonna do this dish soap in here. Thought that would look nice on the countertop. Oh my God, Dash is playing with the packaging on the floor. Are you playing with the packaging? I'll show you. What are you doing? Look at him. All of his toys, but he wants the packaging. What are you doing? I was getting camera shy. Okay, so next package, let's see what's in here. Oh, kind of similar to the one before, but instead of dish soap, I think you put like household cleaner in here. So I'm gonna do this one, multi-surface cleaner, and I think I'll put it in here. And it's just like a cute little reusable glass one. It has this silicone sleeve at the bottom that's gray. So I just thought this was really cute to keep and it's also better for the environment because they're not wasting so much plastic. So I thought that was really cute. It comes with this shower spray, orange and rosemary concentrate. I really don't know what this is. Oh, okay, I see. So I think you put this in with water. It's like a little concentrate and then you would spray your shower. <sighs> hmm, interesting. Anyways, this is what I got from Grove and I'm really excited to start using everything. I just think it's like a really easy subscription type service you have and I think that you can like cancel it or change it um, and change all the products too, but it's really convenient to just get like everything shipped to your door because I know when I go to the grocery store, I never remember household or cleaning products. So I definitely think it was worth the investment. Anyway, so I figured out what this little sleeve was for. It's another silicone sleeve and it's for this soap dispenser. So, just wanted to show you guys. I didn't know what that was for, but then I realized that's what it's for. So it came with two of them. This one's more of like a spray bottle for household cleaner. And this one's for dish soap. So, this is everything I got. Love it. Okay, I'm currently filling up my new soap dispenser that I got from Grove. And I'm using the Mrs. Mayer lavender scent. This smells so amazing. So, I wanted to show you guys what I'm up to. No. Filled it right up to the brim. <laughs> Cute. Oh, it's gonna go over. Shoot. Gotta pour a little bit back. And let's see. Perfect. Fits very nicely. Love it. Here's the new little setup. I don't know why this is like slightly yellow. It's kind of driving me nuts, but whatever. And then this is also the new little soap dish that I got. So I just think it looks really cute on the counter. And I really like Grove so far from what I've been using. So love it. 
Hi guys, so it's a little bit later now. I'm on my way to an Apple appointment right now because my phone is having some issues lately. Sorry, I'm not looking at you, I'm looking at the road. <laughs> I have my car mount in. But anyways, my phone has been having some issues lately where ever since I upgraded to the new version, I think it's like 14 or something, I don't even know. They come out with a new version, I feel like, every single month. But anyways, as soon as I upgraded, my phone started to go really slow and it's lagging. And also, every single time I text, I'll be texting, but no words come up until like 10 seconds after. It's the strangest thing. So I'm going to the Apple store right now to get that looked at. I feel like today's just been a very odd day. I woke up super flustered, I guess. Today's just like not gone how I wanted to, but that's okay. We're going to make this evening a little bit better. I might pop into Zara while I'm there. I haven't gone like in-store shopping in, <laughs> I want to say like eight to 10 months because I'm just always online shopping. Actually, not always. I really don't do a lot of shopping, but if I am going to buy clothes, I always am doing it online because I really can't be bothered to go anywhere. <laughs> and the internet just makes it so easy these days. I might take advantage of it while I'm at the mall and go into Zara because I actually haven't been to that store in forever and I've heard they have some cute new fall pieces. So I'd like to get a few new things, but just wanted to update you guys, let you know what I'm doing. It finally has gotten a lot nicer out. I know this morning I mentioned how it was like cold and dreary and rainy, but it's beautiful now. It's sunny. It's put me in like a much better mood, luckily. So I'm grateful for that. Also, so I'm trying to work on my organization in the apartment. If you live in a small apartment, you will feel my struggle, but how do you guys stay organized? I feel like since the apartment is a little bit tiny, we make it work with two and a half people, myself, Matthew, and Dash, but we have just so much stuff, I don't know why, and usually I'm very much a minimalist, but lately we just have stuff upon stuff, and I feel like I've gotten lazy and just thrown it places, but I really need to organize, so if you live in a small spot, how do you keep yourself organized? I went to my parents yesterday and got a few bins, and just kind of like organizational bins that I can use for closets and underneath the bed, in nooks and crannies of spots where I've just kind of thrown things, so I'm trying to to focus on getting the apartment a little bit more organized especially since now that we have dash love him to death but he has like toys and other stuff that we bought him so i want to try to find like a little area where i can put his stuff the front closet is literally a nightmare i just ordered a few new things on amazon one was a shoe rack because we just had our shoes laying all over the floor if you watch my apartment door the front hallway closet was a disaster so i got a shoe rack finally I'm excited to start organizing a little bit because over time things have just been thrown and I feel like when my house is not very organized, my mind is not very organized. I don't know if you guys feel this way too, but that's how I feel like 99% of the time. So I need to get my organization up. If you have any recommendations of how you organize in small spots and how you like utilize your space, let me know. I think I'm going to watch a few YouTube videos on that because I think that a lot of people have videos on that and I should take advantage of the internet. So. Yeah. into the most gorgeous day today. This is my favorite time of year. I love this fall weather. Okay, so anyways, good news about my phone. It was actually okay. All they had to do was re-download the software update. So they basically just like wiped my phone, backed it up to the iCloud, and then re-downloaded it. And I think it fixed the bugs and the glitches. So we shall see over the next few days if it's fixed. But I went into Zara and I went into H&M and I got some really cute new pieces. I'll do a haul when I get home. I even went into a store and shopped in so long. So it felt really nice to just like treat myself and like be inside of a store. And they had really cute new fall sweaters and like cute going out top. So I'll show you guys when I get home everything I got. All right, Dash. Sit. Stay, stay, stay. Matthew's got to go. Come on. Yeah. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. And there we go. <laughs> so I get home from the mall and Matthew cooked all of the chicken. Wow. Master. I got to say, I'm quite surprised that the chicken's already done. at 6.15. Here is tonight's dinner. So Matthew is so kind over there to cook our chicken on the grill. 
So I just put a bunch of different veggies in it. It's kind of like Greek inspired and then some pita. This is the dressing I use. It's the Greek goddess one. The ingredients are pretty good. I love it. it tastes super good. So I'll do my haul right now. I got a few things from Zara and also a few things from H&M. So I'm really excited to show you guys what I got. Okay, I apologize about the lighting. It's nighttime, so I'm doing this with the overhead lighting. But first, actually, this is my first time trying this stuff on because in the store you can't try anything on. So I got this cute little off-the-shoulder fuzzy white top, and I paired it with these jeans and these little booties. The majority of my haul, I'll probably be wearing these jeans, but I just thought this top was really cute for like fall and going into winter. It's super cozy and so soft. By the way, everything I got I think is either an extra small or a small. This top I think is an extra small. Small, but it has these cute little sleeves that are tighter at the wrist and a little bit more balloon up here So this is my first top and this is from H&M. I love it. I'm obsessed Here's the next top also from H&M. It's a size extra small. It's off the shoulder kind of beige tan sweater I love it. I just think it's like super cozy for fall and also I love anything off the shoulder It's like my fave. So I got this I don't know if I pair it with these types of jeans or maybe like black or dark gray jeans, but I really love it, super cozy, super soft, and I think this was only $29.99, I wanna say, or maybe it was $19.99, so the prices weren't too bad, but this is the second sweater. And then here is the last sweater from H&M, also a size extra small, so it has these balloon sleeves, and it's more of like an oatmeal color. I'm obsessed with this, it's so cozy, so comfy. I think it looks really cute with like tucked in jeans. I don't know if I'd wear light wash jeans, dark wash, but I just think it's really cute. I think it needs to be styled better, like, I think the gold jewelry is cute, but once I, like, actually have my hair done, I think it might be cuter, like, my hair up and high pony. Oh, my God. I am obsessed with this top. So, I got this from Zara. Off the shoulder, it has little ruffles. It is so adorable. And I really liked it paired with the jeans and, like, these little boots. This would be, like, a really cute dinner outfit, I feel like. But I got this from Zara, like I said. It's super cute. And it has kind of, like, a cinched material here. I wasn't able to try this on just because of like the COVID regulation, so I wasn't sure how it was gonna look on. I think I got this in a small, actually, and I'm really happy with it. It's super cute, so I'm really glad I got it. Okay, this is adorable, but it has shoulder padding and it needs to go. So I'm cutting that out for sure, but I just thought this was a really cute turtleneck long sleeve shirt, and it looks really cute with like jeans, like tucked in. Thought this would be a cute kind of dinner outfit, but like these are not a buy. Like what the heck is going on with this foam right here? I'm not really sure. I look like a soldier, you know? Like, you guys know what I'm talking about when they have, like, the shoulder pads? <laughs> this is so not cute. But anyways, the shirt is really cute. These are getting cut out. So this is the third top, or no, second top from Zara. And then I have one more top from Zara. And this is the last one. This is your, like, typical basic black sweater, but I really like the sleeves. Also balloon sleeves. It's kind of a trend in this haul. But... I just thought it'd be cute for like a little basic top. I feel like you can never go wrong with having a few black sweaters, you know? And the quality on this one was really good. So this I probably would wear together with my black boots here and these jeans, but I just thought it was really cute. So I think I got this in an extra small and it's from Zara. But that is gonna conclude this little clothing haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I got three pieces from H&M and three from Zara and everything was pretty affordable priced. The sweaters and the tops were anywhere from $20 to $30, which I think is pretty affordable nowadays. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna end it off here. If you like this video, it would mean so much to me if you give this video a like, a thumbs up, and make sure to subscribe. It allows me to know that you guys like these types of videos and I upload every single Tuesday and Friday, so make sure you have your bell notifications on. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little video, this vlog, this haul, it was like a little bit of everything. And I'll see you in my next one, bye. Oh, <laughs>